We begin tonight with an update out of Jim Wells County. The community is still shaken up after this weekend when their beloved county fair became violent in just a matter of minutes. That incident leaving a 13 year old fighting for his life. Our Alexis Green brings us the latest in tonight's top story. Jim Wells County Sheriff Daniel Bueno called for a press conference today to express his deep concern of the violent acts that took place over the weekend in their quiet town. We're saddened to hear and know about a situation that occurred Saturday at the Jim Wells County Fair, something that never has occurred before. According to Sheriff Bueno, they are in the process of investigating a stabbing turned shooting that took place Saturday night at the Jim Wells County Fairgrounds. That stabbing left a 13 year old boy hospitalized at a Corpus Christi hospital. It's unknown at this time what kind of gun or rifle of any uh, was used. We know that shots were fired. This video sent in to us by viewer Jake Ramirez shows the chaos at the fairgrounds when a fight broke out among several minors. At one point, the victim, who has not been identified, was stabbed and gunshots could be heard near the fair's carnival area. Sheriff Bueno says Saturday's events were frightening for everyone and could have put the county fair's more than 8,000 attendees in harm's way. So this is a big concern for us in law enforcement that now anybody can carry a gun without having to certify themselves, take training or even obtain a permit. According to Sheriff Bueno, they do believe they have a lead on the suspect who did the stabbing, but they need to confirm with the victim who is still in the hospital in critical but stable condition. We will not allow this type of behavior to continue or get started up here at Jim Wells County. Sheriff Bueno is asking for any witnesses of these two incidents or parents of these individuals to come forward with any information and ask that the suspects turn themselves in. Lex the screen, three news.